and uh, on those detail view you can notice dimension shown in a little bit different way you will see this point 103 and uh, here is something something more here plus three thousand and zero okay what does it mean it means it's a tolerance and so it gives a uh, machinist a little bit more information a little bit more specific information how those groups supposed to be machine what does it mean it means the minimum it can be 103 and maximum can be 103 plus three thousands it means hundred and six thousands okay um, if you ask me what's gonna happen with the rest with the rest of those um, with the rest of dimensions uh, let me show you a little bit here okay uh, if you look at the template you will see a little bit bigger information uh, regarding for all the rest all the rest of the tolerances we call it tolerances it's a maximum minimum limits of how we can machine those parts okay so it says if we work in the thousands of an inch which I mentioned earlier we have to take as a five thousands so let's say some dimensions like this one hundred it means minimum is ninety five thousands because hundred thousand minus five thousands it's a ninety five thousands and the maximum dimension is plus five thousand that means hundred five it's for all the rest dimensions and the same story with the angles we have 30 minutes okay that's um this dimensions machines can play with okay and uh, all the rest if you notice all the rest um general information is located in the drawings in the templates i'm sorry whatever didn't fit on the drawings whatever goes sometimes by default uh you can see it's a story it's uh, information about uh edges okay uh the same way it says what kind of code we have to follow um, if you are interested in that all the information about it is located in a it called ASME code 14.5 um, it's a it's a code and all the CAD drafters following this code when we um, working on those drawings okay uh, also you can see here supposed to be title um, it's a it's actually it's the name of a company it's it's a big if it's a big company it's just the name of the company if it's a small company it will provide name address and phone number some advertising you know uh, then it's the name of the part then it's very important what kind of um, material we use uh, to machine those parts in our case it's stainless steel 304 um, if you're interested about uh, materials you can follow uh, machinery handbook it's like it's like general reference for all those uh, for all this information uh, this part doesn't provide and doesn't require any finished coding okay um, we talk about drawing scale one by one so it means on a drawing and uh, actual part are the same sizes here so if you when you machine part it will look pretty much the same size in of this drawing okay um, it gives a name of the drafter of the designer who drawn it uh, then the part number every part has a number in design library and you will see another very interesting part it called sheet 101 one of one so it means if you have if it says like let's say sheet one of two it means here is some way sheet uh, another sheet that means not all the information located on this drawing if you can't find anything you can calculate anything you can figure out some information you have to look at this magic line it will tell you maybe some information is located uh, somewhere else you know so this is important all the general information located in a template sometimes usually before you start reading actual drawing you have to read template it gives you all the general information and drawing gives you more specific information okay